Apparently, evidence they were here is in the landscape all around us. But how do we get a look at this evidence? We fly over it with this bit of kit. So what we've got here is a remote-controlled drone or mini-copter that's operated by Louis, who's fully licensed and trained by the BBC. How good is the little camera underneath then, Louis? For its size, it's absolutely amazing. It's uh, stabilised on this gimbal, so you can see there, if I move it, it stays really steady. So in any high wind, the camera just stays completely steady, so you get these great smooth shots from the air. Beautiful, isn't it? Well, here we are, Miles. I told you I'd come equipped. You reckon this will give us some good shots? Well, I think for some of the things we want to look at, it's probably the ideal solution, really. Right, let's get it in the air then, Louis. Our eye in the sky shows us more than just prehistoric remains. There are clear signs of medieval farming below. It's great with this mini-copter looking at it from the air. What can you see here, then, of some significance, Miles? If you look across, you can see that there's, there's long lines running through the shot. Yeah, those stripes. That's right. Those are what we call cultivation terraces or lynchets. They are basically the remnants of the medieval farming landscape. 